Hello, and welcome to the Wall Vault tutorial by Gamma the Pirate. I just completed the Kong Vault tutorial, which I'll put right here in this little box right here. Just click that if you want to learn how to do a Kong Vault. And so, right now we're going to do the Wall Vault. And it's very simple, it's very quick, and if anyone is chasing you for whatever reason, you're running from the cops, you'll want to come at this wall instead of going around at a gate because they'll follow you directly to the wall, not expecting you to vault the wall very quickly. They, however, will either go around after you do, or they'll vault this wall, not knowing the proper way how to do it, and they'll go considerably slower. Here is the wall vault. I'll do a quick demonstration and then teach you and tell you how to do it. So I put a small spin on that one. You don't have to do that, but it just felt the most natural. And so if you don't put the spin on it, this is what it'll look like. For me, it's just fastest if I put the spin on it because it raises my body a little bit and I just get my legs over easier and quicker if I put the spin on it. But so what you want to go ahead and do is you're going to want to run up to the wall or jog up. Just quickly move up to the wall. Jump about two or three feet away. Two would be best at this size of a wall. And then plant your foot in a comfortable spot. When I'm just standing here, that would be right here. And then you're going to want to push off of that foot. Kind of grab up here in this kind of position. And then you're going to want to take a small step with your left foot if you're going over to the right or your right foot over here if you're going over to the left then if you took your right foot and planted it there then put your left foot on this top of the wall and just boost yourself over simple as that if that sounds simple it's very easy this probably sounds the instructions step by step probably sound complicated and hard to remember, but once you start doing it, it becomes very natural and it's very easy to do. So I'll demonstrate that again now that you know everything to do. So just like that, very easy, very quick. So, the only reason you won't be able to do this is if you don't have enough upper body strength or lower or leg strength because you're kind of boosting yourself up after you jump off of this leg. And you won't be able to do this if you are not fit. Like, if I weighed 300 pounds, this is something like what I would do. I would probably just fall off like that and die. Not really die, but. So, I hope. Actually, there's one more thing I could teach you. I'm not sure if I can do this yet, but a friend of mine, he can do this much better than me. I'm teaching him parkour, and at the same time, he's teaching me some stuff that I have never even thought about. So, what he taught me while I was teaching him was not even to step on the top of the wall or take the second step on the wall. So like this. I'll try and do it. There we go. He can do that much more fluently than I can do that. And it's just naturally for him. 
but that's only if you want to get a over a wall that you know what's already on the other side. So if you don't know what's on the other side, then you take my way. If you do know what's on the other side, and you can do that, then you take his way. So, it's pretty much the same thing, except for you lift yourself up and jump harder, and you just boost yourself over on the same move. It's really difficult to me. But I'm not as strong as him, so I hope you liked this video, and if you did, press the like button, wherever that is down there. Or if you're on a really old type of YouTube, that's one of these sides. I'm getting too much caught up on the like button, but it'd be nice if you would like it. And please subscribe if you would like to see more YouTube videos or anything on parkour. Or anything like that. And there's an ant on my iPod that I'm recording with. Yeah, I'm just recording with the iPod Nano. I don't have anything fancy. Just an iPod Nano with a... With a, um... Uh, whatchamacallit? Camera. That's it. Video camera. And... I think that I'm getting pretty good screen resolution, so you don't need all this fancy stuff to make tutorials or videos, any show reels. It'd be nice if you could post a video comment, in, or any kind of comment, so that I can know how I'm helping you, and that I actually am helping people, instead of just being another video on YouTube. And please, just go out and try it. Remember to stretch. And any stretching tutorial, any stretching that you don't know how to do, I'm going to make a stretching tutorial soon. Um, when I do make that, I'll post the link right in this box. Yeah, that's a box, okay. Kind of a box, whatever. And thank you for watching, again.